Attention, please. I want to make a public statement. I'm a black man, and I want you to understand something. I want to thank each and every one of you for being out here today. However, you will not carry your signs inside of a grocery store. You will not carry your signs inside of a bank running your errands. But what you can do is support these vendors, support these black entrepreneurs that have shirts so you can show your stance and let your voice be heard without ever, ever having to say a word. Do not make this a moment, make it a movement. Register to vote right here. This is how we create change. I'm just a black man, I'm just a black man making another statement. This is just another PSA brought to you by Public Statement Apparel. Thank you. Y'all come on over here and fuck with me, man. LAPD is notorious for abusing us. LAPD, I didn't say the California police, I said LAPD. I hear you. I'm just I know you hear us, brother, but I want you to feel my pain. I, okay. I want you to take my pain to them. Take it to them. I can't even vote. So somebody vote for me, man. When I told him my story, on what was really going on and how we really feel, not how I really feel, but how the, 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 the black youth feel. The tears poured, I rose my voice, I yelled on, this, on that man, and I was frustrated, but I feel like I had to give him my frustration so he can take that frustration and that anger and that pain back to who he uh, speaks with that make these laws. I was asking myself, what can I do to make a change? What, what exactly can I do to be a part of this movement? Because I don't want to make it a moment. I need it to be a movement. So I ended up uh, creating a brand, Public Statement Apparel. I wanted to put my, my thoughts on a shirt because a lot of people want to know how I really feel and, and, and how black people feel, the youth, how they feel. Wear a shirt that shows your stance. Keep the conversation in high priority so that this movement can keep on moving. That's what it's about, man, spreading the message, the good word. We're trying to cross color barriers, color lines, we're doing all that. Educate yourself. Start looking into uh, black public speakers. Start looking into Angela Davis. Listen to Malcolm X and what he was talking about. And as you're listening to these things, I want you to think about all the tragedies that have happened from the time that they were speaking in alive to the time that we have today. And ask yourself, what has changed? What has changed? We have to keep the energy high. We have to keep it in conversation. We have to keep talking about it. We can't make this a moment. We have to make it a movement. And in order to do that, we have to keep it in people's face. We have to keep it in people's face that Black Lives Matter. We have to keep it in, in the people's face that united we stand together, we march. We have to keep it in people's face. I really want to see change. I'm not out here selling shirts trying to make a dollar. Yes, I'm a businessman. Yes, I'm a black entrepreneur. But this is what generates change. Awareness and educating. Is it enough that we feel broken down inside? Is it enough? Look how many died, we've had enough. All the sacrifices don't add up. And it's not enough, it's not enough. We don't feel safe. Do you feel like we deserve this kind of pain? You see colors we see through you and your head Blissful lies, the heart souls crying, you're insane You should be ashamed yeah.
How many of my brothers and sisters you gon' take from me? I come in peace, but your peace is already aimed on me. This ain't the land of the free if you tell me freeze. God forbid if I sneeze, you gon' pull before I could breathe. Damn. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. We need equity. We only know what quality hatred inside your policy, bruh. This is deeper than giving us some apology. Wow. We came from the colonies. You wonder why we so upset. It's been 400 years. We still got changed. I was like, chill. Others watching the news. I don't even know what to say right now. I'm thinking candles, sick of laying flowers on chests. If you ain't black, don't say you understand my pain. I'm so overcome with that. Since I was 10, I was looking over my shoulder when I was like, emotion. It's not like a. I'm daydreaming. It's not a hurt. It's like so much joy and watching so much pain. I, I can't believe that you put that together like that. I can't breathe. I can't. I can't breathe. I can't breathe.